I said I was gonna deal with clown flower and I meant it because clown flower was never even supposed to be there. I just accidentally created it. So him. the first thing I did was use white paint to change the proportions because they've been driving me nuts and they're not perfect now, but they are better. And I'm gonna paint the background a different color so the big white splotches really aren't gonna matter. Though it was surprising to me how challenging it was to paint over the white paint. I mean, I started painting this mural on a painted wall and I've continued to paint over the things I've already painted in order to change them, but the white paint, it was like dry. I don't really know how to explain it, but it wasn't my favorite. Anyway, I added some petals. And thankfully, I've been been able to color match pretty well despite continuously buying the same wrong shade of yellow. Oh, and I thought it would be cool to shade the last petal differently. So instead of having yellow at the tip and red at the base, yellow along the edges into a red center. And I'll be honest with you, as soon as I started to make this change, I also started to doubt myself. But as it turns out, I was right when I thought it would be cool because it is cool. Also, I forgot to mention, I decided to keep clown flower. In part because he grew on me, but mostly because my kids begged for him to stay. But I knew he could be better, so I gave him a makeover, and now I enjoy his face on my wall.